Hi everyone, thanks for joining me for another weekly planning video. This week I'm going to be planning for the 8th to 14th of April and I'm going to be using this Planner Girl Problems Kiki K B6 kit. I have used one of these before so I'm really excited to use this one again. There's a few new extras in there. So there is the beautiful silver foiling, there's also a little habit tracker and some more decorative stickers in there as well. So definitely very excited to give it a go. And I also have my first ever rolls of Simply Gilded Washi, which I'm excited to use in this spread as well. So I'm going to get started by putting down this bobby pin washi strip down the side of my page. I'm just going to do this on both sides, hole punch the holes out, pop in my date covers and then get started on the rest of my week. section as usual I want to put the weekly checklist there and a habit tracker I just wanted to make sure it would all fit because I also wanted to use some of that washi tape in here as well but I put the washi tape then the weekly checklist then the habit tracker and it fit perfectly that I forgot to put my date dots on so I'm just going to quickly do that before I get into planning Monday but on Monday I'm starting off with one of these larger box stickers to mark in my shift time at work and a few to do's that I have for work because this is regular matte sticker paper it doesn't have as much give if I put it in the wrong spot so I just wanted to be really careful when placing the stickers down because it's almost impossible to get them back up Underneath that box for my work stuff, I wanted to put a smaller one just to mark in that I have a lecture in the afternoon. I usually don't get to watch these live, but I like to mark it in so I can remind myself whether it's Monday after work or on Tuesday that I can go back and watch it. And then I just use two of those little bow stickers as checkpoints for any other to-dos that pop up. On Tuesday, I'm starting with one of the more decorative boxes. Then I'm just gonna lay over the top a like another box for my shift at work so I can mark that in and then in the gap up the top I'm going to use some of that simply gilded washi tape to make a little bit of a page flag and I do end up going in and adding one of the glitter headers at the bottom of the decorative box to mark in the bachelor in paradise is starting on Tuesday so maths is finished bachelor starts beautiful on Wednesday, I'm just starting off with a glitter header at the top and then using a box underneath to mark my shift time at work. Underneath this, I use one of the bow checklists and a to-do sticker just to mark off any to-dos I have for the day. I don't have class this Wednesday, which is super exciting. So, I don't know, I'll probably end up not using it to do uni work, but just relaxing or probably watching Bachelor in Paradise, to be honest. And then that's the first half of the week done. It still amazes me how easy these kits are to use. Like it makes such a big difference when everything fits in your planner. So I'll probably be buying another one after this video. Every time I use one, it makes me want to buy another one. Anyway, on Thursday, I'm starting off with another one of the decorative boxes. This is more of like a cheetah print one. So on Thursday, again, I want to mark in my shift time at work. It's also mine and my boyfriend's anniversary. So I wanted to pop that on one of these larger boxes. There were some really cute decorative stickers as well. There was one that said love and it was made out of like these pink balloons. It looks super cute so I put that on there as well. And then 
in the little gap, I'm just going to make another little page flag out of that Simply Gilded Washi Tape. It fits perfectly up there. If you've seen some of my other videos, you probably know on Friday I just like to have a really long list of everything that I need to do or that I have on that day. It's my, I feel like my most productive day off that I have during the week. So I like to have a big list and then also mark in that I wanted to film another plan with me video for the week after. And then I got a bit excited because I saw how cute the weekend banner was so I wanted to put that down straight away before I even finished Friday. I put it flush against the bottom of the page even though it wasn't in line with where the box kind of finished if that makes any sense. I just wanted to make sure I wasn't taking up too much room on Saturday or Sunday but I also really wanted to use this sticker because it was really cute. Then on Sunday I'm using another decorative box Kind of jumping around a bit. I just like to make sure I don't mess anything up or I have weird stickers left for Sunday that don't really tie in with the spread. Over that I just put another box to mark in my shift time at work and then I'm going to use some glitter headers above it. These are really easy to write on if you have any um, like other things you want to do that day and you don't need a ton of room so I just like putting these in there as well because I don't really use the glitter headers that often I might as well just make the most of them and not waste them. So then for Saturday I put down a little bow page flag sticker at the bottom and then above it I put a larger box and then a smaller one on top. So the larger ones to mark that I want to have my assignment pretty much done before next week and then the smaller one is just for something else that pops up on Saturday. I'm using the rest of the decorative sheets up the top of the page and then popping in the month and week sticker. They're in the exact same style as the like day covers, but they cover that like insert perfectly. icon stickers these are all from the kit I haven't used anything from outside obviously other than the washi tape so it's very comprehensive and then just gonna fill in everything I know that I have on and there we have it here is the finished spread using the planner girl problems kit I definitely would recommend these to anyone using these inserts so thanks again everyone for watching and make sure to check out how I fill out my planner throughout the week on Instagram. Bye!